Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome yourself back. Not really back. Welcome yourself to a random little video in which I will be talking about the brand new Samurai Jack season. You're probably like, why the fuck? Because I can. Now in all honesty, this is more so kind of like, th th think of it like a test video, kind of to test the waters. So you, you need an online what? Thank you for telling me what I need to do, game. Now back to what I was saying before my Wii U so rudely cut me off. Um, this, th think of this series as kind of a way to sort of test, or, or not this series, this video to sort of test the water to see if you guys would like to see me just sort of discuss random junk here and there. So if you would like to see more of just me talking about stuff like random fucking cartoons and shit of that nature comment down below what sort of stuff maybe you'd like to see maybe you'd like to see me talk about like cartoons i used to watch maybe fucking brand new cartoons shit like that because today i'm talking about goddamn samurai jack's new upcoming season because the new trailer for that came out um the day i'm recording this but technically the day after is when this video is going to be posted so you get the point so of course, if you guys don't end up even liking this shit, don't worry. If you guys don't like it and don't want to see more of this, I won't fucking do more of this shit. But if you guys really like this and really want to see more, you know, I'll just... Every once in a while, I'll do some of these, you know? Oh, we're playing Rainmaker. I... I fucking love Rainmaker. But yeah, let's talk about Samurai Jack, shall we? So, straight up. Um... If you're not aware as to... My age or anything of that sort, I'm... I'm, I'm 18. So, I kind of grew up... Um, with like, Samurai Jack, that sort of kind of shit, you know? Like, um... I was growing up around the time that it came up and such. Of course I didn't understand every little thing that fucking happened in it or whatever, but it was a nice little series regardless and I really did enjoy it. Uh, but overall, it's like... I don't know, dude. From the moment that I heard it was coming back, I was excited, of course. And you know, if I'm perfectly honest, I was a little worried as to how things were gonna play out about its releasing and everything, because they did go pretty silent on it for a while. So as a result, you know, of course, I'm I'm sitting there thinking like, oh god, what the fuck happened to it, you know? Like, did, what? Like, what, what the fuck's gonna happen to it, you know? Over time, they started releasing more information, and then a couple weeks back, I think they actually revealed the fact that they were like, okay, we're gonna release it March, whatever, March 11th, I believe it is? If not, then the correct information will be on screen. But so they released that wonderful info to us, and um, truth be told, let me tell you, the fact that it's a March release is actually insane, because not only are we gonna have f the fucking Switch coming out in March, first off, that, I <laughs> I already have my pre-order for that, I, I've been had my fucking pre-order for that shit. Oh, uh, this poor guy's gonna fucking die. Uh, but not only are we getting that, we're also getting fucking Samurai Jack around the same sort of time frame, like, that's actually ridiculous. Oh, fuck off. And, like, honestly, that trailer that they released, like, I don't know, I'm always very, very, uh, fearful about trailers because... Trailers... Uh, tra trailers are a very scary thing. Trailers can either make or break the excitement for a series, like, straight up. That's the way I see trailers. Maybe, not, certainly not everybody sees trailers those way, or that way, rather, but... That's certainly the way I see them, because um, if a trailer is done incorrectly, it can make a really good series, a really good movie, really good game, really good anything look absolutely terrible. You know, think of it, think of it, the, think of it the same line, along the same lines as like an advertisement, <laughs> like Splatoon. <laughs> it's, it's those advertisements for Splatoon certainly didn't make me want to buy this fucking game. You're a kid now. You're a squid now. But I digress. What I'm trying to get at is. Uh, you know, I'll admit, I was very much so afraid that this is just gonna be a shit trailer that doesn't show off anything good or anything of that sort. But it ended up being the exact opposite. It ended up being a really goddamn good trailer that does its job, that showed off a lot of shit that, you know, you would probably have questions about as a Samurai Jack fan, you know? And if anything, I'm just super excited for it now more than ever. Like, truth truthfully, I was already pretty fucking excited for it. Like... Mostly because, you know, I grew up watching Samurai Jack, I really liked it, you know, of course I was really bummed, you know, when it when it got cancelled and just had such an abrupt ending, but what are you gonna do? I didn't even realize there wasn't a shield over the fucking Rainmaker, I'm an idiot. So really, now it's just more so a waiting game. Uh, if you're wondering for more information, if you're wondering, like, more information about the release of the new season, first off, it's only one season. It is only one season, it's not like a complete new series, it's not anything of that sort, so... Only one season. It's 10 episodes, or so they've said. Uh, I'm not sure what's gonna be the runtime for every part. 
But at the very least, there has been confirmation that the first part, first episode, whatever you want to refer to it as, is the typical, you know, like 24 minute length. As for the rest of the episodes, I'm not sure. So it's 10 episodes, first episode being, the, you know, the standard length that you would expect from a cartoon of that caliber. Um, what else, what else, what else? You know, like I said, one season. The whole premise of it is, and I actually kind of like that they uh, did it this way, is it takes place like 50 years in the future. So like, shit's completely different. It's all, it's not completely unrelated, of course. There's gonna be shit that was, uh, that does involve like the old Samurai Jack and all that sort of wonderful stuff. But it's essentially made in such a way where it's very approachable for new people who may have never watched Samurai Jack. Which is great because... You know, uh, while it does give a conclusion to, you know, those longtime Samurai Jack fans, it also does sort of, you know, introduce a lot of new people to Samurai Jack who may have never watched it because not everybody's an old fart like me. I'm technically an adult. I'm 18. <laughs> but yeah, I suppose that's all I really have to say about it. I'm really excited. Let me know if you're really excited for it too, with a comment down below, as well as, you know, your suggestions for what else, for what other topics or whatever, what other junk to talk about in these little videos. Oh, it's sort of wonderful junk. Played pretty shit, uh, although we still won, but hey, hey, be, be easy on me. This is my first time playing Splatoon in a while because I've just been so busy with life, but... Anyway, that's going to be it for this little topic video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you have, be sure to drop a like as well as a comment. Be sure to subscribe if you're really feeling it. And I shall see you guys next time. Bye-bye.